Good morning, my dear students. How are you all? Today is Tuesday, 28th of April, 2020. Our topic is staying safe. Today, we will open our student's book, page 56. Our objectives are speak about the importance of water, do exercises in student's book page 56. Are you ready? Are you ready? Yes, and English loves you. Let's get started. Reading and writing page 56. Let's read then do the exercise. So for this part we have to read about tiger shark, blue ringed octopus, box jellyfish and then we have to fill in the blanks. So let's read. Let's read about tiger shark. So please read with me tiger sharks often swim close to beaches so sometimes they attack humans their teeth and jaws are strong enough to bite you in half so we have to remember this information to fill in blanks okay Let's read about blue ringed octopus. Read with me, please. The blue ringed octopus has a venomous beak. Its bite is deadly. So we have to, yes, remember this information. Okay? Now, the last one. Let's read about box jellyfish. The box jellyfish has long venomous tentacles. Its venom can kill a human in three minutes. So we have to take all the information and then fill in planks. Okay? And now let's go back to page 56 and fill in the blanks. We have three animals. Tiger shark, blue ringed octopus, box jellyfish. The first one, the has a venomous beak. Which one of these animals? Yes, blue ringed octopus. Next, the sometimes attack humans. Who can say the answer? Good! Tiger shark. And now the last one. The has long venomous tentacles. Who can say the answer? Yes! Box jellyfish. You are great. You got all the answers. Students book page 56. People need water. Work with a partner and talk about why people need water. Mm -hmm. We have to think. Think and think why people need water. Mm -hmm. Let's see your answers. Let's get some answers. People need water to... Yes, to drink. Right. People need water to wash clothes. Right. So, water is so important in our lives. More and more of answers. People need water to... 
to water the garden, which means to put water to the flowers. Notice here that water is a verb. People need water to wash ourselves, to keep ourselves clean. So water is so important, right? You are a hero. Yes, you are a hero, my student. You know why? I'll tell you why. You are a hero because you fight coronavirus. Yes, you fight coronavirus. You wash your hands every day from time to time. We should follow these steps. One, water and soap. Two, palm to palm. Three, between fingers. Four, focus on thumbs. Five, pack of hands. Six, focus on wrists. That's why you are a hero. Fight, 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 my hero. And now in our student's book, page 56. Let's do the first one. Write three things that people need water for. So let's think a little bit about three things people need water for. Yes, who can say the first one? Mm-hmm. We need water for drinking. Another thing. We need water for cleaning. The last one. We need water for washing. So drinking, cleaning, washing. Right. Now for number two, it's up to you. It's optional one. Draw a picture to show one thing that people need water for. Write a caption under it. So if you wanted to draw a picture, it's up to you, my dear. Okay? And now let's play. Let's decide these things float or sink. Float means move on or near the surface of water. Sink means go down below the surface of water. Let's see these things. Coin, rubber band, wooden stick, fork. I'll give you time to think. Ready, steady, go. Time's over. Let's get your answers. Coin. Sing, right. Rubber band. Float. Wooden stick. Float. And the fork. What do you think? Yes. Sing. You got all the answers. Good job. By the end of our lesson, thank you, my dear students, Ramadan Kareem, and stay safe. Bye for now.